Code Differently is a program that me and my partner started because we wanted to make sure we were investing in the next generation of technologists. Um, so we put this program together to make sure that we were creating immersive, real-world experiences for students to get at a younger age so that they will be empowered to be in tech in the future. In partnership with NCC, we looked at the current internship program and we were trying to figure out a way to create a technology internship. The issue is that a lot of students coming in don't have the immediate skills to be able to actually work and produce products. So by a combination of finding the right clients for the students to work with, finding also the right teachers slash mentors to work with them over the summer, the students were able to pick up skills so that they can actually be productive and also provide value to the uh, clients that they're working with. The summer program is really a pilot for the Thousand Kids Coding Initiative that we're going to push out over the county through the course of next year. Um, it's really was a, the summer program is really was a time where we can kind of look at what are the things that the kids want, what are some of the areas that we really need to focus on to make sure that we don't have a lot of time to spend with the students, but we want to make sure that everything that we're doing is impactful and also focused on real world workplace skills. We created in county government a thousand kids coding. The reason we created it is in America today, the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics estimates there are seven million unfilled jobs. There are seven million job opportunities and there are about six million people looking for jobs. So what are the six million people looking for if there are seven million available jobs? Why don't they just go take one of those jobs? Well, the problem is that a lot of Americans don't have the skills needed for those jobs. And a lot of those jobs are software jobs. And so if there are a couple million software jobs in this country and the young adults and adults across our country and even right here in Newcastle County in Delaware don't have those software skills, they can't get these jobs. By the time they finish this program, which is just one summer, by the time they're done, these students will have skills that they can leave with, that they can sell to the market. They'll have marketable skills where they can go and offer services to the marketplace. From the very first day I met them, they were extremely professional, and I had no idea how old any of them were and what high school they came from. I just knew that they were teenagers. Based on their maturity and their ability to communicate with me what they needed from me as a business owner, as well as what they were going to provide me as a business owner, I left completely impressed thinking that they've done this forever. Today, I had the first opportunity to really get to know them a little bit personally and find out what schools they went to, how old they were, and I was completely taken aback because I was under the impression that they had been coding for some time prior to meeting me and they had been a part of this lifestyle and this career for some time and this was something they were interested in pursuing when I found out that they were placed and then sort of learned this throughout the process in the last few weeks I was completely taken aback. Um, the kids are amazing. I don't even know if I should call them kids. These young adults are super professional, super on it and even though some of them don't know what they want to do, coding gave them an opportunity to figure out things that they may want to do, things they may not want to do and how they could apply it to maybe a future business or something that they would like to start. Before I was in coding, I had no knowledge of coding at all. It was really just uh, unfamiliar to me. But jumping into it, it's a real attention grabber because it's like, wow, you can make your own stuff. And it's like, you get paid for it at the same time. So if, you really, if you're really dedicated to making your own stuff, liking doing web design and stuff for people and pleasing the customer, I think that's the good part. I don't think I would have ever looked at coding as an option for me before this program. I don't even think I probably would have got introduced to it without this program. Matt Meyer, Newcastle County Executive at the Route 9 Library and Innovation Center, here to say thank you. Thank you for our amazing summer youth coding program to J.P. Morgan Chase. Capital One, Insight, 
Discover Bank PBF Energy. That's the Delaware City Refinery. Look at this. They are our future. We are the future.